Hello and welcome to British English Pro. My name is Anna and today we are joined by the fabulous David Garrido. Now David is a professional TV presenter and he's here today to help you with your presenting skills. My name is David, as Anna said. I've been a presenter with Sky Sports for almost six years. Before then I was a presenter on BBC Radio for almost a decade. So if anybody knows what they're talking about, it's this chap here. So today we are going to cover the four C's of presenting. Be calm. It's important to have the right approach, the mindset, and that's where calmness comes into things. Don't be phased by what you're about to do. It's not life or death. It's only speaking in front of an audience or speaking on television. You have to be calm and that will set you on the right path. Hi there, welcome along. This is Nice Weather for Ducks. Let's get an update with Anna. Yes, breaking news. The prolonged rain has caused severe flooding in the north of England and this has led to some severe issues on the M6, which has led to a number of severe accidents. Um, Anna, take it easy. Do you want me to take over? Please, David, thank okay. you. So there have been severe floods in the north of England, uh, some rail disruptions, there have been travel delays, but the emergency services are out and about and they say that the situation is generally under control. Thank you, David. Be confident. The best people on television come across well because they are confident, because they are themselves. They have self-belief, they don't think about trying to come across a different way. They are just natural, and by being confident, you will come across to your audience better. Hi, hello, welcome to uh, It's a Scorcher for um, the second day in a row we are here in Brighton and um, we are going to be talking about the fantastic temperatures. That yes, yes, we absolutely are. It's such a hot day out there, you'll want to get out there and see it for yourself. The sun is out, skies are blue, 38 degrees Celsius. That's a record-breaking temperature for this time of the year in Brighton. And not just the south coast that are benefiting as well. Even in Scotland, we're seeing temperatures that are seasonally higher than average. So make sure you get out there, wear your sunscreen, have an ice lolly and enjoy it. <laughs> yeah, lollies. <laughs> Be conversational. Sometimes people talk with a different tone of voice or they use words that they're not used to. Well, that's not very natural. If you're conversational, you'll come across more natural and you'll put your audience at ease. You'll be more trustworthy. So that's why you should be more conversational. Hello and welcome to What the Heck is Going On With The Weather. If you've looked out of your window, you might feel a little bit discombobulated. That's right, it's cold out there, albeit bearable. Thus, make sure you go out with your biggest coat. That's right, wrap up warm. Does, what do you say, David? I say, what the heck is going on with your voice and, and with your vocabulary? Discombobulated? People don't talk like that. If you talk like that down the pub with your mates or you know, maybe you're going to go and see some friends have a coffee, you do not talk like that you want to talk about talk about the weather and talk about how cold it is sure but obviously you know just take care it's cold out there you want to wrap up warm be careful on the pathways on the road especially if they haven't been salted they're going to be a little bit slippery and those temperatures should rise in a couple of days time so hopefully it won't last too long and this is the way i talk no it's not <laughs> it is no all right it's not <laughs> be clear Make sure that you take your time and that you speak clearly. The reason is, the quicker you speak, the more likely it is that you will stumble on your words. If you enunciate the words properly, and you take your time and you're paced with your delivery, then you'll be clear and your message will also be clear. Time for a travel update now. How are those roads and railways looking? Anna can tell us. Well, those roads and railways are looking absolutely crazy, to be honest, David. The leaves have been falling so rapidly over the last few hours that we've seen leaves on the line. That's right, I'm saying leaves on the line. We all know what that means. Yes, that means that the trains are going to be delayed and severely. Um, are you going to take a breath 
at any point. I mean, you are just careering away here. Let, let me show you how this is done. Yes, there are leaves on the line. It's been a concern in the past, but you've got to make sure that you actually take the right trains and you arrive at the station early to give yourself time to deal with that delay. Yes, the uh, rail authorities are looking into it, but do you know what? It should get resolved sometime soon. Thank you, David. There we have it, our four C's. Be calm, be confident. But also, be conversational and be clear. It doesn't matter what scenario you're in, if you're doing an interview that's being filmed, if you are doing a big presentation, if you're talking to any kind of audience, then those four C's will massively help you. I guarantee it will be 500% easier. And if anyone knows, then David does. So thank you, David, for joining us today. It's been an absolute pleasure having you on board. If you want to follow David on social media, then there are a few links in the description box below, along with links for our social media. If you're not yet subscribed to this channel, then please do press the big red subscribe button so that you don't miss any future videos. And if you're interested in speaking with a standard British English accent, then why not head over to www.britishenglishpro.com where there are lots of courses available to help you at very affordable prices. So all that's left to say is happy practicing and goodbye. See you later. The presenter, David, why don't you tell the you? There we go. <laughs> <laughs> And today we are joined by the lovely David Greedo. <laughs> I have pronounced that correctly. You have, yeah, that is okay. my name. Yeah. <laughs> Hi, welcome along. This is nice weather for ducks. Anna. Sorry. <laughs> Do you have any? Um... <laughs> uh, yeah. Yes. Uh, breaking news. As you all know, there's been. Oh, shit. Do it again. <laughs> <laughs> Hi there again. Oh, sorry, you were, gonna, you were about to start, weren't you? <laughs> <laughs> this one is because... Well, that's a lot of outtakes though, isn't it? So um, it's similar I, to... I, 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 I could do... Hello and welcome to what the hell is going on with my voice? I don't know, that was, that was a big one. <laughs> Looking crazy out there. We are having... An... <sighs> okay, busy. I'll start. There we go. There we go. Yeah. There, there it is. <laughs> so that concludes our videos. Videos. <laughs> How just... are you? We doing? <laughs>